What's up guys and welcome to my first Samsung Galaxy S5 tutorial. So today I want to show you how to enter download mode to flash a custom recovery, kernel or a custom ROM. Also in downloading mode you can check a NOX status. That NOX thing is really interesting because there you can see if your warranty is void. Basically there are e-fuses in your smartphone, like on the Xbox 360, which get locked when you modify the software. That means you cannot reset them. Once your phone is flashed the warranty is gone. Ok, and now enough of talking and let's enter the download mode. Ok, so now before you can enter downloading mode, you have to make sure that your Galaxy S5 is powered off. So mine is on, that means I have to power it off, so just give me a second for that. And shut down. And now just wait until your phone is completely off. So just be patient, wait a few seconds and then you will hear or feel a short vibration, which means that your phone is completely powered off. Ok, now to enter downloading mode, you have to press a special button combo. So you have to press the volume down button on the left side, the home button and the power button at the same time and then you keep holding them. And just keep holding the buttons until you come to a screen with a warning message. Then you can release the buttons. Ok, now carefully read the warning message. A custom OS can cause critical problems. Also you will lose your warranty if you flash a custom ROM, recovery or a custom kernel. And if you still want to continue, just press the volume up button. If you want to go out, just press the volume down button. Ok, your phone is now in downloading mode. Here you can see do not turn off target, but that just means if it is connected to the PC and you try to flash it. If it's not connected, you don't have to worry about that. Now in downloading mode, you will find some information here on the top. You will see that your phone is in Odin mode. That means it's ready to be flashed with the Odin flashing tool. Then you will also find your model number here, mine is the SMG900F. You will see if reactivation lock is activated or not. And then we come to Nox warranty void. And as you can see, I have already flashed my device because the Nox status says here 0x1 and by default it's 0x2. So if you flash a custom ROM, a custom recovery or a custom kernel, then your Nox status goes to 0x1 which means your warranty is gone and you cannot reset that. And some people said they will still repair it also if you have 0x1 if there's a hardware fault, but I'm not sure about that, so if you want to keep your warranty for 100%, don't flash your smartphone. So keep your NOX status on 0x0. And now I want to show you how to exit downloading mode. So here it says downloading do not turn off target, but this only means if you're flashing the smartphone right now, then do not turn it off, otherwise you will brick it. But we are not flashing it right now, so just keep pressing the power button until it turns off. And then you can press the power button to start it. So basically it's that easy. And then you will be back in Android. Ok, so now I've shown you how to get into downloading mode to flash your smartphone. And in the next video I will show you how to flash a custom recovery. And then we will flash a custom ROM to the brand new Samsung Galaxy S5. So stay tuned for the next tutorials on the Samsung Galaxy S5. I hope this video was helpful for you. If it was helpful, please leave a like and subscribe. I would be very happy about that. So as always guys, thanks for watching and I hope to see you again in the next videos. Bye bye.